Hi, this is Michael Buffer, and let's get ready for Baylorick TV. Doug Box Promotions here with Bayloric TV. We meet finally, Tommy. Yeah, nice to meet you. Nice, uh, better than Skype, eh? Yeah, brilliant, yeah, much better than Skype. Absolutely, so, cracky show you got on here tonight, by Thank the way. You. Um, so, uh, Dominic Akinlai that we saw early on, dropped in the first round, Yeah. gets up, puts on a cracking finish. Your thoughts? Yeah, it was, a, it was an unbelievable performance, obviously, you know, he's, he's gone, uh, he's, he's rolled the dice a little bit tonight, or we all rolled the dice, and. You know, he come through it, a little scare in the first round, but listen, that's what we wanted for him. We wanted a test, we wanted him to be ready for the big things in 2017. I think he's ready, to be honest. I think he's ready now to make a real big push, you know, towards the English title. You know, we can even have a look at sort of maybe the Commonwealth through, but certainly the way he's going at the moment, he's, um, he's, he's looking good, and this will be doing him the world of good, this, uh, this performance. Let's have a talk about the other guys that are on the bill tonight. And a couple yeah. of guys brought on, uh, Ches is it Chesney Hawkins? Yeah, Chesney Hawkins, he looked fantastic. I mean, obviously, first, first fight tonight, his debut. He fought against a, a, like a tough Eastern European. Listen, he's, he's a journeyman, but the, the fact of the matter was that Chesney Hawkins can punch. You know, he looks like a really, really solid, like welterweight. So hopefully in the future, hopefully get him on some more shows, and um, yeah, we can uh, yeah see how he goes on. But yeah, he looks on for the future definitely. Richie, could be his last Richie name. Richie Gray. Yeah, had a yeah. long chat with him. Mm. I talked to his fans, mm. talked to him, and talked to his. Sponsor, yeah. Wow, what a backing! He's well supported. He's he is. a fantastic young man. You know, he's a really likable fella. He's obviously second fight tonight, so, so that was again another one on another notch, if you like. So yeah, he's coming along nicely. Again, Alec Wilk is doing great work with them. So you know, a good little team there. Okay, Richard Williams, a couple of his fighters tonight for. Yeah, well, Marcus is still to come. That yeah. one's still to come. Obviously, right. Ashley Demet's great win for him early doors. Really happy for him. Yep. Um, you know, he's he's coming along really nicely. Again, you know, we're developing these fighters and we're developing them well. And with Ashley in mind, we knew that he was uh, someone that we're looking to develop um, for the long term, you know, not just the short term. So, a good win for him tonight. We'll see him out again in probably January. So, okay, the one person that didn't fight tonight yeah. is AJ Carter. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, obviously, his fans, you know, Obviously, he's not fighting. He's been cancelled. Yeah. Any? Is anything you can say about the fight being cancelled? Not at the tonight? moment. You know, obviously, we're going to make a bit more of an announcement. Obviously, next week. But you know, it's really bad news. Yeah. Not for thought of AJ. We're just going to have to obviously make an announcement on Monday, Tuesday. And uh, listen, at the moment, it's just about you know appeasing everyone, enjoy the night, and uh, hear more on Monday. But you know, we've said what we're going to say tonight, and I think most people in the hall are satisfied and happy. So that's the most important thing. So going forward, when will we see when will the boxing fans see AJ again or fight, see him fighting? Actually, hopefully December. If we can, if we can arrange um, a show in December, which we're looking to do as we speak. That's what we began for. We began for December, early December, um, first week, first week or ten days, and then um, yeah, we'll be good to go from there. But we have got another showing at the end of January, so there's definitely dates there. And as I said before, you know, hopefully the fans won't have to wait much longer until they see Big Dog in action. And let's talk about very quickly Dove Box Promotions. Let's talk about what your division is for Dove Box Promotions. You as a promoter, what 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 are your what are your, what's your vision for Dove Box Promotions? Hello. Sorry, mate. Yeah. It's okay. Uh, Dubbox Promotions is obviously uh, very much in its infancy, you know, it's three fights in, this is the third show, and we're obviously very happy with the way things are going, you know, you can't get everything perfect, it's still very much a very, very kind of fresh, fresh promotion, promote the uh, boxing promotion company, so, you know, we're taking it every single show as we go, we're getting better, the shows are getting better, but, you know, we're still learning as we go, so it's good. Tommy Dove, thank you so much for your time. Thank you, thanks for having us. Cheers, mate. Appreciate Take it. Take care. Thank you. See you later.